Hi there, everybody. My name is Mark the Shark. What in the world? Welcome to Doom 64. <laughs> Classic Doom. Game starts. There's enemies just waiting for you right there. There it is, the super shotgun. We're not going to roll with it just yet. So these are nightmare imps. See how they're kind of purple and translucent? They're equivalent to normal imps, sort of, except they move faster, their projectiles shoot faster, and they're a little harder to see because they're translucent and purple. Now, the brightness for the game is up a little bit for the sake of recording, um, but trust me when I say back in the day when you were playing on those old giant boxy TVs, because that's what video games played on, and the brightness was definitely darker than this, the Nightmare Imps were actually hard to see. Oh, look, you see? There he is. So you can see they move much faster, and their projectiles move much faster. Now, I kind of remember this level. There's like a... I remember there's like a center stage thing that opens up where you get different keys. And I remember this is also... Here it is. This is the level where you also meet the Cacodemon. And they are scary. And I do not like them. <laughs> The Cacodemons in Doom 64 look like the pain elementals in, um... Alright, these are just regular M's. In Doom Eternal. Okay. Now there's a secret over here. One of these doors, one of these, these corners has a secret, and I think it was, um... I don't want to get the blue key yet, because I think... I think some bad stuff happens once you pick it up, so I want to clear out the enemies first. Which of these had the secret door? Ah! Oh, there it is! So there's an invulnerability. There is no reason for us to get that at this time. Oh, I guess nothing attacked us. Okay. Let's go to our chain gun. I don't know why we would need the invulnerability. I can't remember if there is a reason to need it. And I almost feel like it's cheating to use it. <laughs> but, eh. Ah, there's the Cacodemon. All right, hold on. Let's, let's just super shock on him. Woo! One more. Woo! Got him. <laughs> I love the classic death animations. The death animations in Doom Eternal, obviously amazing. That's why they introduce glory kills and all those awesome things where things just blow apart and everything and there's like destructible demons. But the classic Doom animations where they would just like, they're individually animated as frames. You just, there's something about that. That's just, I don't know, charming. <laughs> I know that might be strange to hear, watching these demons die, but... I know I'm playing a little bit like a girl right now. Or... Like a, um, like a baby. <laughs> because there are some pretty good girl gamers, just saying. Uh... But I'm trying to conserve all of my health. Ah! If you think I'm playing like a little baby, well, that's your opinion. No, you, you actually have to play like this. You, you, go, you wanna play a little bit cautious. I'm not trying to do a speed run here. I'm just going for the wins. I'm going for efficiency. I'm going for uh, maximum health, maximum ammo. That's all it is. So I do play with a little bit more, I think Lost Souls Ambush is here. I do play with a little bit more, um, caution. Wait. Wait. Alright. I thought there was a secret door. Ah! There it is. <laughs> you gotta, like, just run up to it and it will open. Alright, where are the Lost Souls at? Bring it on. Cacos and Lost Souls, where are you at? Kill the Lost Souls first. The Lost Souls are, believe it or not, far more threatening than Kakos. Kakos just provide bullet hell that you can dodge, right? They're pressure units. Because they can fly, they can constantly pressure you, but they're not that bad. Um, Lost Souls are way... On, on my like priority list of what to kill, 
Lost Souls are definitely higher than Cacodemons. Usually, usually. Whew, okay. Doing good, doing good. Taking minimal damage. I still hear an imp around here. Where is he at? Also a classic Doom fashion. They, they give you all sorts of ammo for guns you don't have yet. <laughs> Hold on. I'm just making sure I have all this ammo first. Okay. Let's get the yellow key, guys. And let's go back. Here we go. Let's move. I think there's imps in here. No, am I wrong? No, it's, it's this room. There we go. A simple sidestep. Oh. What? There we go. There we go. Ah, there's the rocket launcher. So I think there's another one. Whew, almost. Ah, I don't want to use this. Super shotgun versus shotgun. Regular shotgun. Whoa. There you are. I think there's another one down here. There we go. Um, I guess for the sake of the lulls, we'll just use the invulnerability here. Sure. I don't really know why, but... I think there's like a bunch of lost souls or something that attacks you here. Now normally, I wouldn't walk into the room like this, but... Because I took the invulnerability, which... Is some sort of cheating in my opinion, because <laughs> you really don't need it. But hey, it's there, whatever. Um, eh, just being a little bit Rambo. But I don't remember how to do this part. Ah. Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay, hold on. Ah, the secrets in in the old Doom games. Wait, oh, I'm doing it wrong. No, I didn't make it in time. They were always so complicated, so that switch activated the red key, so you gotta run in here. There it is. Get on the corner! Wait, how do you get up there? What? What? What's the way to get up there? Hmm. Hmm, I'm confused. Activate the door. There it is. A little, like, square comes up. And now we can bamboozle these bamboozlers. You guys try to bamboozle me, I bamboozle you. Whoops. I actually can't really see him. There we go. Cleared out the imps. And the red key should now be here. There it is. And where was the red door? This is the red door. And you can see we cleared all the imps. And that's it. And there it is, guys. See, these are just fun, short little levels. I have such a blast with them. They do get significantly harder. Some of them are scary. Um, one of the, the levels that is really, really special to me is coming up. I think it's like level six. But until then, and until next time, keep on dancing.